Hey everybody. Well, since I'm sitting here at my desk <laughs> trying to talk myself into doing the recording, oh, excuse me, because it is Saturday morning and it is a little after nine and I don't know why I'm procrastinating, but I decided I'm just going to do this and stop procrastinating. So I have a whole bunch of stuff ephemera for today I want to use and of course this is all my um, other things cute things I want to use put the paper here and oh, so adorable just goes so well with all that pinky theme I'm doing all right so I'm gonna put that back and I do have several things to put in, so that's good. So let me just get all my things out that I want to use. Let's see, how am I doing on this? Ugh. Oh yeah, I'm like right at the end. In fact, I am at the end of this one. I kind of wondered about that. All right, well, let's get a new Uhu glue stick out. And it looks like I'm gonna have to order pretty soon, but I still have a few. So we'll get a new one. Get that all set up for using, and let's see what we can put in here today. All right, so. We have quite a few pages full, filled. So we have Starbucks, so that's always a big thing. And there was my baking of the Yulikaga, uh, the Christmas movies, which I'm all caught up on. So now um, I should be able to keep caught up until they're all done on the Christmas movies. And Sisterhood, and some food and other bought items. Here was Thanksgiving. Here is some things for the tree and other holiday decor. So that was Christmas decorating. Um, Christmas shopping done. So that was from an Etsy shop. Um, Here's the postage stamps, which I do have some to add to, so I'll come back to that page. Uh, some candy and Sadie's birthday, her 10th birthday. And this was Bethel University, the event that they put on for us. So that was the last one on December 3rd. So now I have several things. Um, I have another coffee one, which is Dunkin' Donuts, and I'm super happy that they've got the pink. And I just tore this, so I'm going to actually cut it. So I went there and I had their holiday coffee. You know how Starbucks has a holiday coffee blend. And I imagine that a lot of places do that as well. So that's pretty common. So we had our first really big snowstorm of the season yesterday and overnight here in Minnesota and it ranged really the the totals I live in the cities so the totals north of the cities uh, there was a sharp cutoff where there wasn't anything or there was very little and then where we were on south there was a lot so closer to where my husband works there's like 18 inches um, places ranged anywhere from 8 to 19 inches in the metro area. And we actually got 15 inches here in Bloomington. So, lots of snow. <laughs> That's for sure. Okay, so some, I wanted to put this down then. So I'm just going to glue this down. Put it in here for my coffee. So I'm going to 
put that like this, I think. I got some of the stuff peeled off of it, like the back, because this was from the actual cup, but not all of it. And I'm gonna cut this off right here. Okay, all right. So we'll just kind of press that back on. And I'll probably put some washi tape here as well. I haven't gone to Caribou. They always have a drink as well, Caribou Coffee. Um, <clears throat> so we'll see if I if I make it to Caribou as well for something. We'll, we'll get that figured out. So I think I wanted to just put one of these guys in here with the Dunkin' Donuts. I think this one, Panda Bear. So, just because of the colors, I feel like it goes well. So we're gonna put him there. And then I think I'll save, maybe I should save that for when I get another one, I'm not really sure. Um, we'll see. The other thing I need to do is get some washi in here. So let's use the pink Santa. Yeah, so we got tons of snow. It's days like that. I am so glad that I work from home because whew, I can't even imagine having to drive in something like this. <laughs> and thankfully it's the weekend, so yeah, there's a, there are a lot of people that do have to work, but um, at least less than they normally would have to be working. Let's just do another little bit down at this other corner with this washi. You can just kind of Go like this. I think that helps. And I'm just going to pull that, push that over a little. So there we go. That's a start. And I would like to have another coffee thing on this page. So I might just kind of leave it open a little bit, maybe. I'm not really sure. Let's put a little bit of a green stripe here as well just to hold it down a little better all right so that's a coffee page then um, I wanted to go oh yeah I've got some things like some candies as well so I just want to put a page where I can set these in there um, another thing we do is um, we do sausage and cheeses um, and crackers, and that's a big thing as well during the holiday season. Uh, I can't put the cheese, I got some really nice cheeses from Aldi, but I can't put the cheese ones on until um, I've, we've used the cheese. <laughs> so. So what I think I'm going to do is just kind of place it in here and make this a two-page spread as well that I'll come back to. So I'm going to hope for some caribou coffee. I will put that there. And then the next two pages will be specifically for the meat, cheeses, and cracker packaging. So let's just start with this bit right here. And that's all we have at the moment, which is fine. Um, I think I'll go ahead and put on just a strip of this washi tape. I'm just gonna do it kind of like a gift, I think. And this one will just go across here, just as if it was a little 
gift package. And then on that side, I believe I have a plain red. So we'll just go a red one. And that'll just kind of prep, prep the page for when I can add the other elements to this. So I've got some pages where I have to come back um, and add things, and that's okay. Um, I do want to put the candies, so let's go to the next page for that. So just some different ones. So here's one. This is Jelly Belly Holiday Favorites. Um, I do want to trim off a little bit of the excess bulk. Some stuff we don't need on there. And there's also like the flavors. So I kind of want those to be in that little peek through window is my plan. So if I do this, let's do the, um, this part first before we whoa, <laughs> move that around too much. So I'm gonna put this here, and then because it's like a window, I can put this underneath it. So let's see what we can do. All right. Let's, I like to show the different kinds. So there's a few flavors, um, eggnog, candy cane, pumpkin pie, cranberry sauce, and hot chocolate. And they're okay. Um, the only one that I really didn't care for was the, um, was the pumpkin pie, or not the pumpkin pie, the eggnog was just like, not a very good flavor at all. All right, so I think I'm just gonna kind of hold it in place like this. Okay, and I'm gonna do just a little bit right here too, and that will that will keep it in place, okay? So just some of the different treats this time of year. And then here's a couple others. We have the Dots, or the Mike and Ike, Merry Mix, Lime Cherry, and Holiday Punch, and we have the Christmas Dots, Cherry, Lime, and Vanilla Flavored Gumdrops which they were okay, but because I like dots, but they weren't like really fantastic. I was kind of disappointed in the dots. Mike and Ike is always good. Just very, very sugary. <laughs> That's for sure. All right, now, ugh. so let's put, there's gonna be lots of holiday candies, of course, as we get more and more into the holidays and people give us stuff and yeah. So I think what I'm gonna do is just put this on the next page and just kind of leave room for more of that sort of thing. Then I can just, like I said, I can come back and um, just keep adding different things to these candy pages, the treats. So yes, yeah, so we have a bunch of partial papers <laughs> and those will be, these pages will get filled as more items come in. And then um, I did gift wrapping. So let's, let's do that. Here's all my gift wrapping stuff. So then let's go here for the gift wrapping. And what I wanna do is I've got some lovely paper and I would like to kind of get the whole page kind of covered 
not all the way because there's more things that will come on here, but it's just easier to do it like, oops, like this. Okay, I like that. So then we'll come over here and we'll cut off this part. All right. And then some more papers. I've got this one. So cute. So I basically have three wrapping papers. This was a new one I got this year, um, and I really like it. This cute snowman, he's from last year's gift wrapping. And I have another one from last year, and that's these snowman hats, or the Santa hats, I can't even talk. So, that glued up and on here okay and let's put that one right here okay looks like I've got a little bit of glue that came off of something all right so now here we go And this was like the tags, the two from tags. So I'm gonna put that right here. And then these are some of the sticker things that were for the tags. Oops, that I didn't use. I'm gonna go like this so I can trim off that top part that's I managed to pull the wrong thing on. So we'll just come back here and we'll cut off that a little bit. And then look at that. It was just this cute whole little um, woodland theme that I really liked. They didn't do a great job of cutting, but I got these, the paper and these little stickers at Joann's. And I really like them. They're so pretty. But yeah, they didn't cut them very well. That's for sure. As you can see. <laughs> but let's just put this one here in the middle. So that, that's for the wrapping. So I got one that says not, don't open till Christmas. Yeah, here we go. So let's put that one here. Do not open until Christmas. I was really glad I got my wrapping done because sometimes um, it takes me a while to do the wrapping and then I'm just in a rush and I don't do a really good job with it, which is too bad. Um, so I was glad that I, I was able to get it done. Here's another one, it says, open on Christmas morning. Let's put that one right here. And then we'll put the other, we'll just do the whole thing. We'll start up here, open on Christmas morning. So perfect. There. So that's just my page for gift wrapping. Then I've got some stuff specifically for holidays. So 
let me do this. I want to just get the stamp off. I'm getting some stamps, different ones. And look at this. This is the back of one of the envelopes. Um, and I just love it. So I'm, I really want to put it in here because I just think it's so pretty. See? Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. All right, so that's the back of one of the envelopes that I got. So let's go back to the page of the stamps. Um, wherever that is, right here. And I really want to put this whole envelope piece in here. So I can't do the whole thing, but I can do quite a bit of it. So I'm just going to cut off part of it and keep the rest. That was from my mother-in-law and her husband. Such a pretty card. All right. So let's put that here. Okay. And now we can put on the stamps. Now these are the stamps that um, I bought. And I got these seal ot or otters, otters and snow. And that's the ones that I got. So cute. I wanted to. I got a bunch because I wanted to use them for winter because stamps in, for the United States now are up to 58 cents a stamp. I did end up sending 36 cards. I was only going to do 23. And then I started doing them and I found a list from the year before. And I'm like, oh, I forgot all these. So I ended up doing some more for friends that weren't on my list or that I had forgotten to add to my list last year or whatever, so, oops. Oops, that's upside down. Let's put that one over here. And then I have a Santa. So we'll put him right here. And we'll see what other stamps I get. But that's the ones I have so far. Checking out all my craziness here with my paper for gluing. All right, so some more on the stamp page. And then we started another coffee section. This will be meat and cheese section. This is the candy section, and that was gift wrapping. So, you know, we're getting there. Another thing I did, I do during the holidays is I do knitting. Or I do that all winter, really, but especially for this season of the year, um, I start making blankets that, knitting just kind of lap row blankets that I like to give away um, to the homeless when I get that opportunity. Um, it's not like I'm knitting a ton super fast, but uh, I do what I can. And um, I did notice in Joann's that they have a drop off, like if you do blankets, they have a place that you can drop them off for people, like to be given to people in need. But those look like they were more baby blankets. And a lot of people do baby blankets, and I think that's great. But I'm, I'm doing for adults. I have two completed, and now I'm working on number three. I only did one last year, and I, I did give that away. But yeah, I just, something to keep working on. I'm gonna put that in here. And let's put a little whatever this guy is on here I think 
And the broken candy cane, of course. Oh, the birds are out there getting seeds. I'm sure they need them this morning after this storm we had. So my granddaughter Sadie's coming over today and um, we should be, hopefully, this we're gonna do a gingerbread house. I got a kit at Joann's and then um, next weekend, hope to do the cutout Christmas cookies and get that get that done so yeah there's uh, little plans in the works for things that cute oh my gosh okay so I'm just gonna oh, I want to use this so bad I think I'm just gonna put it there just because it's so pretty and friend of mine did this, gave this for me back when I was, you know, doing more Happy Mail and stuff, and um, I haven't done that in a long time, so, but I kept some of these things, and they're so cute, so I'm putting that in there, and I don't have anything yet for this page. Um, I've got this thing I want to put here, and I want to do um, some kind of decor, some kind of scene, just something fun and Christmassy, but I don't know yet exactly what I want to do, so I'm just going to leave it until I figure that out. And let's put something here. Um, hmm. I wonder how this washi is doing. It's like right, has to be almost at the end. It says winter, burr, it's cold outside. And I think that's a good one for this knitting blankets, right? Yeah, let's just do that, all right? And of course we had our first big snowfall, so maybe it would be fun to do um, something for that. Just kind of a, with this whole snow theme and everything. So I think I'll do that, that would be kind of fun. Since we did get the huge snowstorm. Now, will the snow stick around for Christmas? It's Minnesota, it should, but for some odd reason, we're gonna hit 52 degrees on Ooh, that's the end of that. We're gonna hit 52 degrees on, let's see, Wednesday or Thursday? Can't even believe it. It's like, you've got to be kidding. But yeah, crazy, huh? So let's do a snow one here. And I can write about the snowstorm in here. So we'll put that right here. Oops, kind of keep up with that wintry theme. And then get this last of this washi tape right here. Oops, well, that didn't work. I guess I'll put it in the middle and here. All right, then let's see what can we use to, it's kind of a fun tobogganing one, but not yet. Do I have anything? Keep saving, I keep saving this. I'm gonna use this sometime. Not yet. All right, anything else we could use in here that would be fun. Uh, have this, hot cocoa. I've got this tree, the other half of this tree. 
which even though it's a different blue than that one, I do kind of like it. So I think we'll use it and just put it here anyway. Right smack in the middle. Because why not? And then I got this cute cup of cocoa thing. And I'm just gonna put that right there at the bottom of the tree. I think I'm gonna to have to get a new one of these because this one's cracked. It's, it's had a rough life and I've had it for a long time. All right, anything else we want in here? Hmm. I wanna do a whole winter scene with the elves. I've got the different cute, cute, cute things. I've just got this whole darling set that I want to use sometime. Just not yet. But soon, I'm just looking to see what else I got in here. If there's something I can use. Um, let's put this here, because why not? It's a little cardinal. Kind of a weird little piece not quite sure what it's for but we're gonna stick it right there and then I can write in here about our snowfall I think that will be good all right so I think we're good with all of that and let me just move this out of the way so then really all I have to do now is the writing so we're all set. Did quite a few pages in here, so I'm happy with that. And of course I got pages we gotta finish up, but it was fun to do. Like this is a complete page. And that's a complete page. And we're getting there on the cards, but not yet, but definitely improving. So yeah, that was fun. Thanks guys for, um, being with me on this. See you next time.